Hey, what's going on guys? Average Tech Guy here, and today we are looking at the Mini 360 Plus by EasyViz. Now, this is a smart camera for your home, kind of a little security camera. It gives you 360 radius in 1080p. So that is an awesome picture that you get, and it actually, if you can put it in a central location, it covers your whole room. Now, this thing is really, really nice. It, um, like I said, it shoots in 1080p. It has a motion tracker on it. I don't know if you can see it moving, but if I put my hand out, it actually follows me. And it, you can actually turn this on or off, but it follows whatever's moving in the room uh, at the time. Now, you can set the speed that it actually follows things to. It can go a little slower, it can go a little faster. Now, the cool thing about this is that you can set this camera and basically just forget it. Um, you can monitor it from anywhere that you go. It actually has three different modes. You can do pan and tilt, you can do 360, and you can also do the auto tracking, which I just showed you. So let's get into the camera a little bit and see some of the features through the app that we have. And the first thing we're gonna look at is that pan and tilt mode. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the app on my phone and I'm gonna actually pull up that pan and tilt mode. So let's see, As you can see it's in pan and tilt mode and this is how you would control it. So you can move it and it's actually doing the motion thing. So let's turn off the auto tracking. So that's the auto tracking, got that off. We're gonna go back into pan and tilt and we're gonna actually move this camera. All right, now this actually works wherever you are. So if you're at work, you wanna look in on your house. If you're at the park, you wanna look in at your house. If you're on vacation, you wanna look in on your house. This is the way to go. You can circle the whole room and see everything that's going on anywhere in the house at any time. Now, another cool thing is you can take a full panoramic image of the room just by hitting that button and hitting take. It'll take that picture and then you'll get a sense of what's going on actually in that room at the time. Now, another cool feature is this thing supports audio. If you notice, if we can get it to see right here, you have a little speaker. I have it off because you get a lot of feedback, but you can actually get audio from the room that it's in and it really picks up well. Another key feature is night vision. Now, I know you may be saying night vision, why would you need that? But say you're on vacation, somebody breaks into your house, this thing records in 1080p, it actually stores it in a memory card, it has a memory card slot in the back. If I can get it turned around, right back on the back, there's a memory card slot. You put a micro SD card in, it records. Um, when that SD card gets full, it actually erases the older images and then it fills up with the new images. So you got the night vision. It actually works really well. Um, I've tested it out a couple of times. Really like it, really, really like it. Um, only bad thing about this camera is it's Wi-Fi enabled. So what I mean by that is it's, it doesn't have a hardwire system. So if your Wi-Fi goes out, your camera goes out. That's the only drawback to this setup. Other than that, I love this camera. This is one of the best cameras I've seen out there. Uh, one of the easiest to set up. Basically, you just hook it up to your phone, turn on the app, it asks you for your Wi-Fi, you connect to your Wi-Fi, you set your phone right by the device, they recognize each other, it picks up the Wi-Fi from your phone. Once it does that, it connects and you're online. Like I said, only bad thing about this is if your Wi-Fi goes out, your camera goes out. So that may be a down, a drawback for some people, but for me, it's pretty simple. I like it. Um, Wi-Fi hardly ever goes out and if it does go out, it usually comes right back on. So I haven't had any really major issues out of this. So five out of 10, um, 
Uh, maybe we'll say seven out of ten. We'll give it a seven out of ten. Pretty decent. It's a solid camera. You have the memory card. You have the slot. You can put the memory card in. It keeps up with your data. Like I said, a nice, nice setup. So if you're looking for any kind of little smart camera for your home to kind of do a little monitoring, Easy Viz Mini 360 Plus is a go. Hope this helps someone. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Until next time, Average Take Out. Peace.